Okay. I got Josh started washing. Then I showed him what I was going to do to buff. Well, he jumped in and started buffing. Now, I don't know what he's done or how well he's doing, but he knows what he's doing somewhat. So we'll see. It's turned up way too fast. That could be the buffer. Hey. So hang on a sec. Okay. We weren't going to buff. We were just going to do the rest. But we weren't going to buff? Well, no, you needed to talk to me in between, but that's okay. Oh. You kind of know what you're doing. We'll see. Are you put any marks in it? There, I did accidentally put one mark in it. You got to not put marks in it, Josh. I, I know. It wasn't, it wasn't well, it doesn't matter because on purpose. Oh, you pulled it right off the fucking whole mirror? God damn. Dude, you're killing me, Josh. That's the only mark, though. Yeah, it's in the most noticeable spot in the world. You want to just take the paint off the other one, too? I painted this, too. You didn't just oh. do a little. You did it all. I was, man. I was oh, getting this piece, fuck. and then it like, did some weird thing. And... Yeah, some weird thing, all right. Primer, everything. Fucking A. Right down to the white. <clears throat> I don't even know what... Get out of there. Go, go do something else. Let me look at this for a second. Okay, hang on. No, hang on. Okay, number one, you should know that that's turned up too high. And that's part of the reason it did something weird or something. That's why you shouldn't have been fucking buffing and why I took it and hooked it and didn't have you buff. I never told you to buff. I never said, Josh, please buff this car. No, nothing like that. I said, we're going to buff this car at some point. So the self-starting thing's kind of good, except for I wouldn't want you to start buffing on my car, or my GTA, without talking to me. And it really, really, really is not good so let's stop okay. because i don't want to use that fucking buffer anymore and i told you that when you were buffing the mercur i told you it needed to be returned that i needed to get a different buffer it was going too fast the speed control wasn't working and that seems to have went out the i spent the time to take this mirror off to paint this mirror and to do everything to this mirror personally and then you fucking scratch up the only thing i mean it's all me <coughs> So definitely, let's not buff. Um, I was gonna have you go on and keep washing. I mean, don't you get it? That's why I started that and told you we're going to wash that. Okay. Talk to me a bit. Talk to me as much as you can. That way we're good communication because you've even got no list. So I mean, you're not keeping track of what we're going to do. You're not taking it down. There's not a whole lot, but I wish I wouldn't have clear coated this. Alright, I'll give that a wash. I think so on that. Dude, look at how bad the pad is. You're gonna buff my really good expensive car that I've told you about over and over how nice it is with that. It's junk, dude. It's a $2 pad to begin with, Josh. Hopefully this thing stays running long enough. 
to be. Keep it running. Figure that happened. To go up the second street up there, have you been to second street? If I saw it, maybe. Is it like near like Mary's Donuts or is that a totally different direction? That's Santee. Okay. I got a GPS. I mean, I'll be able to get there. We'll get the Tum Tum. My Tum Tum. <laughs> um, okay, well, Harbor Freight's up that way. Okay. You just kind of go up all the way to Main Street, make a right, and it's up there. I'm going to give you a credit card and have you get another one of them. You got to start. Offer. You got to start paying attention to that. I already told you it was going too fast. I already told you speed control was broke. We already had a thing about it when Colin was here, for fuck's sake. Why'd you have to do the mirror I painted? You didn't like my paint job? I'm sorry. Um, I know that's like, your, like a really nice car. And it's just, it's not the best car in the world, but it's going to be the nicest thing you've buffed, and you need to make sure that you're got everything in line to begin with. If you're starting with a shitty pad, and you're starting with a shitty buffer. It's just setting myself up. To, to do a shitty job. I mean, it's just, you, you're not, if you're thinking about it beforehand, you go, hey, Nate, you know, this pad looks pretty bad. Don't we have another one? Or, you know, hey, this buffer, you said it was doing this. I mean, fucking remember something for fuck's sake. Well, By the time it's- Because you were using it already. Well, I was just doing a spot to make sure and I was being extra careful. Don't do as I do, do as I say. Okay. <laughs> I'm a lot more experienced, and I'm going to fucking do something differently, and if I do it, then I can only got me to be mad at, and it's all on me. That's why a lot of things, I don't even have people do them, I'll fucking take over and do it, because then I ain't got nothing to complain about. I'm going to complain about you about it if I fuck it up. Right. But this kind of stuff, this is fucking insane. I mean, of course it's going to fucking do it. It has only got half the pad left. It's like the whole thing's set up to fucking scratch the car. We should sell these as scratcher pads if they want to scratch their... <laughs> um, so I want to get another one of them and bug the shit out of him. And that means kind of just drive up and stop there. <laughs> hey, what? Just drive up and stop. Okay. Yeah, just drive up the road and stop at his place and say, Hey, Enrique, how's it going? Uh, I'm Josh. And I came up with Chuck to drop off the... And just walk in through his place and point at the car. Okay. Drive up to the back. Hey, did you go into the back? Yep. Yeah, just drive up to the back and walk in through the back. That way it's right there and you can point at it and he'll connect who you are because he speaks Spanglish. And it's kind of combined thing. He won't understand what you're saying, but he'll go like this. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to know when it's ready and I want you to actually put your hands on it, open the door, look at it, and see how much work he's done. Are the seats in it? If the seats aren't in it, walk in a shot and go, oh, where are they? And we'll start looking around. He won't know what you're saying, but he'll know. But he'll know you're looking for the seats, right. and so he'll point at him, and he'll take you to him. Um, he might have the vinyl or the leathers up on the counter, sewing them. I want to know where he's at on it. Okay. <clears throat> to where? I mean, he should already be done. It's been a week. Yeah. And a half. It's been two it's weeks. Been, I was say, it's been longer than that. So like, and if he's not done, say, oh man, we really need this one. He's already been paid. He's got paid to do that two and a half months ago. He's got $500, $600 of my money and that's only going to be 200 bucks. Oh my God. So like. Are you paying to keep it there too? Or no. Okay. When he's done, I'm going to get it. Right. If he was done, I'd have already took that there and I wouldn't have fucking took pictures without it. Jeez. I would have gave him a hundred bucks to do that seat. Because that would have looked a lot nicer. Yeah, I know. It's all torn up. Um, so find that out. Well, let's go get a... Oh, I thought I might have it in my pocket, but I don't. Awesome. You hid my fucking clothes in the bathroom. I finally found them. You said put it in the shed. In the shed. Oh. Oh, my God. I, I just got some weird things. That's the shitter. That. Yeah, that is. Sorry. It's not a shopping cart. It's a Dude. carriage, Josh. 
And now that I think of it, like, why would you want your clothes in the bathroom? Like, that's gross. On the floor where all the toilet water runs when it overflows? <laughs> I mean, jeez. I don't know. Talk about shitty. <laughs> yeah. Sorry about that. <laughs> okay, so you're going to be in charge of this whole thing. That means... Which one am I getting? What do you mean, which one are you getting? Um, which... I already told you, you're getting the same one. We're going to return that one when we're done. Tell them it's broken. Oh, but don't return it yet. Return it at a different time. Well, you're going to take a look at that one. I might as well bring it with me to where... No! Don't... Okay. Take a picture of it or something. I'll take a picture. Because we're going to scrub the shit out of that one and make it look like we haven't used it much and return it in two weeks with this receipt. Oh. Oh. <laughs> but we got to wait long enough to make it look like we could have <laughs> used the piss out of it. Oh, my God. It, it ain't my fault thing falls apart in three or four months. Yeah, the handle's like coming off and everything. And See now, stuff like that's normal maintenance. You should learn to tighten your buffers up and different stuff it's like that. And they just will do that. Now the yellow one I got in there, it's to die for. It's the, <laughs> it's an awesome buffer, but I need a fucking switch that I can't find. And it's a three hundred dollar buffer, two hundred eight dollar oh. buffer. Oh, the Dewalt. Yeah, it's so nice. I mean, it might be two twenty nowadays, but. Still, it's a lot more than $39, $36. You don't want that one breaking. Now, you're going to have to do this. You're going to have to learn to do this every fucking place you go, Josh. Okay. I do it at the soup plantation. I do it everywhere. Every fucking where. Harbor Freight Coupon. And then the first one or two, I'm going to hit the second one. Could be different on yours. It'll upload it, boom de boom Boom, 20% off. Jeez. So it'll be $35 or something and you get $7 off. Just showing this coupon. Okay. It's pretty cool. Soup plantation, you go in, it's $10.89. You look up a coupon, it's $8.99. And that's for the um, buffet. Yeah, so it's we'll like have to go there sometime. two dollars almost. It's good food. I love it. Ooh. What, what's it called again? Just so I. I'm gonna give you these today too. What? Those? Google yeah. Glass. Yeah, they're gonna go back. So there'll be stuff up here at the the up store. You know what the up oh, store yeah. is? UPS. Hey. <laughs> uh, now everybody understands what the up store is. Yeah. <laughs> up store? What do you mean? <laughs> um, so cool. You're good. But um, just um, just so I can write it down. What's the name of that place at the Zika? Like I, I know the vicinity, but I. Can't. I don't have a clue what the name of it is. I don't know. Okay. It's called like a Pilo Loquito's fucking upholstery. Just up the street on the left. Yeah, you know where it is. You've done been there. Yeah. It's been a couple of weeks, but I'll okay. find it. You just see it and slam the brakes on and turn around. You'll <laughs> find it. A couple scripts up okay. and down the road. Um, try Baris. Hmm? Baris. Baris. Baris upholstery. Baris. And um, why don't you throw two gallons of gas in your car to where you got a couple gallons in there, and it'll definitely take care of what you're doing. Oh. Plus, plus you'll have a little extra for when I say, "Hello, let's go grab this." Okay, don't threaten me. <laughs> He's a good kid and he does well. I can't be too mad about him burning the paint off the thing. If he would have waited for me, it would have happened, but I want him to self start a bit too, so. What are you going to do? Tell me I owe him money. So, yeah. Is that not the case? Yeah, it's not the case. Yeah, it, it almost sounded like he was giving me the runaround. He was. He's had it there for so long, he hasn't worked on it yet because he didn't get a call back from Samantha. Come on. And how much was the Ferrari? Five and a quarter or 550? period 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 also how much did we have Chris send him I thought I had him send him a bit extra this is why you gotta look and you gotta try she didn't look she didn't do shit and I fucking gave him 600 bucks already towards a fucking job that cost 550 and I had the customer send him 575 I think 
So he's had 1150 bucks on a fucking $525 deal, and he's bugging me about $200 in a fucking seat. When right. he, he owes me 550 600 He owes me 600 bucks minimum. He didn't even mention that. Oh, no. He's waiting for me to give him a check. Oh, my God. Waiting for me, my ass. He's just fucking stalling. No, I fucking, I don't know. He does good. It's your fault for not going up there sooner. Oh. You should be like, dude, Chuck took that thing up there. Isn't that Jeep ready yet? I keep asking you. I keep saying, dude, like, we should do that Jeep when it gets back. Huh, I wonder when that's ready. Man, I remember where that is. I could go get it. Oh, no. That's it? I know, I'm just kidding. Okay. I asked and everything. I showed her the picture. Okay, because I'm going to bring this back here in about a couple weeks, so I want to make sure I'm getting the same one. Okay, well, you got that, right? Yep, I'll get that together. And... Don't lose this, and don't lose any of the stuff for it, because we're going to have to wrap that other one up nice. Okay. And we're going to have to degrease and make this look as nice as we can, so cleaning that one up will be big. So do you want me to do anything... Just assemble it and that's it. And then work on the Jeep. Did you do the other side of that one? You did that I side did the of whole it? Left side. The whole side that's still in the shade. Yeah. <clears throat> we'll see where we're at when we want it. I kind of left this because it wouldn't start. Um, throw the charger on it again. Okay. Maybe not. I thought I had it warmed up before and then it... Oh my god! <laughs> Grab it! Why not? You want to touch that thing? It ain't gonna do nothing to ya! Ah. You claim you like animals so much, but you won't touch that little it's, four bug. He's always smashing into everything! Because he's lost, he's coming here to die! They're dying right now. It's dying? Yeah, it's dying. It'd be dead in a day. Is it the heat? No, they're June bugs and they don't last that long. Just the life cycle? June beetles. What do you do? Whoa, shit. I knew it. Damn. Maybe just push it then? <laughs> <laughs> Josh, toughen up a little bit. It went right at me. Damn, why is it doing that? RPMs are too high. Oh, and then it just cuts it. Yeah, it's too. Damn. Maybe when it warms up a little more, but like. Oh yeah, it sounds, sounds like lowering a little bit. Ah, oh, that's cool.
Let's see if it does it again. It just amps up too high. Well, not really. <laughs> the carburetor needs some work. Oh, okay. It's catching. It's just too much idle. So it's idling too high. Not idling. It's fucking rubbing. And so it's just going. Yeah. Um, this ought to be interesting. Was it smoking? It was so scary when it caught on fire. Oh, it's just all the extra. It wasn't scary, Joshua. It was on fire. So what? And then the ground caught on fire. Oh my. I thought it was going to explode and do like oh. a dump with all these cars. You've watched too many movies, dude. <laughs> You've watched way too many movies. Well, I've never seen a car go on fire. Okay. You got a lighter? No. <laughs> <laughs> you want to see it twice? No. Um, it's a good thing you got over the, got the fire extinguisher in time. Okay. See, we're safe, Josh. Safety first. All this has to get off here. A lot of it will get by soaking it. Don't get all this too wet. That's You don't want to get all this too wet. You can get this. Okay. You get all this. This can be cleaned. Don't blow water all over that or that air filter. Don't get much on the air filter? No. Get all this blown off. There's your buddy. You must be blind. What? That's a good spot. Yeah, go right in the fucking hut engine. Why don't you get a string? A string? Yeah, you tie a string around that leg. How'd you do that? Do it in flying circles. It's like oh, a little kite. That's mean. What do you mean? Oh, that's mean. You're fucking scared of it. Oh, oh. Dude, that thing's gonna burn up and die. He's gonna die. That's a hot engine. You're, re you're, you're just repeating what I said. Poor little guy's just looking to die. Ah! He, he, <laughs> he's committing suicide down there. Seriously, that's... See, well, get down there and get, rescue him. Where is he? If I was you, I'd rescue him. Where'd Don't you feel sorry for him? Yeah, I really do. There's another one. I think that's him. Oh, he must have escaped. I don't think he's so suicidal, Josh. Yeah, that's him. Okay. Are you your mind at ease? Yeah, a little you bit. You feel rested? I do. Okay, so... You know, oh, there he is! <laughs> okay, so... Don't get this all too wet, the wiring. Other than that, just kind of stay away from those wires and that wire is back there, the distributor cap. All this can be blown off and looking good. These need to look great. This needs to be scrubbed back. And that's the main thing. Okay. So get under the hood. Get the good grease around all that. Get air in the tires, hopefully, before you wash it. It's always important. If the air in the tires is first, that means you're going to be scrubbing the whole tire instead of not scrubbing the part that's not flat. I mean, you're just missing part of it like that. You can't possibly scrub that whole tire when it's flat. It should be the only one that needs it, though. But it's not a huge wash on this thing because you're not going to pull anything out of it. Just scrub hard and get all the dirt off. The interior is basically done on this thing. It's going to be a quick wipe down. I've done it six times. Six times? Um, these have to be aftermarket. No, they come with these. That's cool. Okay. Um. Ah, that's neat. <laughs> Other than that, yeah, undercarriage. Undercarriage? Well, uh, I parked it this way specifically to be a little easier. That is easier. You gotta knock the fucking cobwebs off the goddamn thing. Right. You know, I've got, I don't wanna blow this gasket jizz off. It's brand new. But. Don't blow it off? <laughs> don't blow that, that okay. stuff all off. That's fucking hotter than a fucking witch's titty. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You know, this has to look better, all the cobweb. Just clean it up a bit. The pan, the pan though, get that though, right? A little bit, yeah, clean it up. Right. And then the chrome's gonna be a big one on this one. I can't even see who's calling me. Are the mothers? We're out of the mothers. No, you've got a mum. Okay. <laughs> Hello? We've already went over this. We yes, what can I do for you? I don't speak a lick of Spanish. I do taco, burrito, and all that stuff, but that's about it.
I don't have that anymore, sir. The only van I have is a Pontiac Montana. That's all I have. But thank you for calling. My dad. Pretty heavy. Yeah. Pretty heavy for this, huh? Eleventh pair. I get a tan, dude. I'm fucking white, and that's white as him. I know, I got the great farmer tan going on. You already done underneath? Not yet. something with the power washer. Well, Josh is out here working on something somewhere. I don't know what he's doing exactly. Breeder just woke up right behind me. I just heard her. We've been going for about three hours. I've got brand new Google Glass. And for some reason, I always forget to push the button on a new one. There's no reason for it. And I feel like there's no reason for there not to be a battery charging. Man, I can't run him around and tell him everything to do. If everything in here is charged, that's good. Okay. Chrome polish. He couldn't find what I had me polished chrome with. And the way we all put stuff back in here. <coughs> I don't know how to explain to him where it is. Keeps throwing these wet rags in here. What is he? I don't even know what he's got going on here. Maybe we'll just redo them all today. How's that? How is that? We'll just wash them all and start over. Okay, now this here, this side has to be buffed out. He sprayed off the motor. What's up with all the batteries on the shelf in there? Batteries on the shelf? Yeah. What about them? Sorry. What's up with them? Um, Hang on now. So everything inside on that thing isn't charged? Well, it was at one point, but... Okay, wait, wait, wait. Died. I told you to, yesterday, I told you you're going to have to start and get everything charged over, get the batteries out of the cars. So, you're not even thinking about that? You don't even list that? You don't have that down? That's just out of sight, out of mind? No, I charged the yellow one. I just didn't... Well, I know you charged the yellow one, and then you put the little fucking handles up there, and you didn't charge nothing else, and you just left it all set. Why would the situation stop? I know. I should keep on... I thought when Colin was here, he had you on a pretty good thing of getting batteries charged. Yeah. Um, well, I think that makes it better. Okay, so that's something, and I know there's 
This should just be done very quickly. Okay. It's not going to come out perfect because it's old, but it is going to make it shine a little better and be smoother and look better. Yeah, it looks better already. So I like this stuff on it for now. Have to poke a nail through there or something. Okay. <clears throat> so that's this stuff. Pop this hood real quick. It's outside. So did you wipe these down lately? The what? The insides. Yeah. When? Um, 10 minutes ago. Okay. I got the pedals. Good. Oh, I got the split the hell. Just, you not even got the handle. You got to pull on the handle, Slick. Push it all the way up. Push it all the way up. All the way up. All the way up. Well, don't pull on the fucking hood. Can't you see what's happening? That side's up. This side's not. Don't yank on the hood so much. Pull the handle. Pull the handle. Handle's up. Jeez, Josh. Let me, go Let me over see. Here more. Let me get in here. Where's the handle? Right there. And what are you doing to it? Pushing it up. Yeah. I don't know about you, dude. Maybe it's just your little tiny fingers or something. I don't know. Uh, oh, okay. Come on, Josh. <laughs> okay, so we got to see what we got for motor stuff. You see vodka or alcohol or rubbing alcohol anywhere? Mm, where is it? Over here. Uh, huh. Look that vodka. I could take a drink. What the fuck, Josh? <laughs> if you're gonna get me something, get the right one. What I look like, one of these people over here? They'd drink this. Oh, yeah, all of them. Yeah, I think they'd take a drink of that. Probably. Oh, yeah. Fucking bridge dwellers. <laughs> bridge dwellers. <laughs> you're mean, dude. You are awful. I'd love to paint this. That looks so good, good painted up. Do you have a rag? Let me Use go. this one. <clears throat> Wipe the back of that down if you would. No, the back black. Okay. Again, look. You get it? Full squirts. Full squirts. Just making sure you're knowing that. Okay. See how there's no spurts really? It just kind of properly atomizes it all. Okay. Yeah. You know what atomizes mean? Um, no. What does it mean? All kinds of little particles, I guess, would be a good, like, you should go, you should go, <laughs> It should be made into little atoms and stuff. It should be made of small and... Okay. That way you don't get much of... We're only getting little bits. Oh, right, right. Sometimes when you do it the other way, it'll just be like... See, this stuff has to stop. There's no way I can have you do something and then look. You didn't even, I don't know what you did here. Did you not wash it off after? I mean, it's the same thing here. I mean, and I just went over that side and left you with the wand on this side. It looks like you see the grease there. I mean, this entire thing has a little bit on it. But this mainly, look at that. Now, there's no way I should be doing that. There's no way this stuff, I should be spending money for products to soak into something that's not going to soak into. Okay, whatever. Spray it down.
I think we went about three and a half hours of cardio this week. In three days. Yeah. <clears throat> right? I think so. At least three. At least three. I think we did 40 minutes on the stair stepper, maybe. I don't know. Oh, right, right. Not an hour. I think we maybe didn't do an hour. No, we did an hour. We did an hour. Did we do yeah. an hour? Yeah, because I remember I was like, oh my god, but you wanted to keep on going. So it's three and a half hours. Yeah. That's a lot of... A lot of cardio. That's more cardio than I did in the last month, probably. Before this last month. Before this month, if I went back four weeks from now and say, okay, June. That's more cardio than I did all week, all month. Same with me. I mean, not as far as walking. I do some walking, I mean, but... That's not really cardio. No, not to get on and just actually fucking get your ass sweating and just fucking, you're walking. Right. And you can feel it, too. You're like, oh, man, I'm going to step this up for a minute. And you start feeling yourself start sweating a little bit more. Your body temperature go up. Get and you get... Pretty cool. It is pretty cool. It's going to get pretty boring pretty fast. What? Oh, cardio? That. Yeah. How do you make that exciting long term? That's true. Just knowing that it's good for you, I guess. Oh, yeah, that really does it for me. <laughs> kind of like fucking kale and cabbage. I just love that because it's so fucking good for me. Right. Jeez. Yeah, I know what you mean, but I don't see it happening. <laughs> it would be nice. Okay, this thing is clean, man. Yeah, it is. Okay. Even though it's sort of, I just wipe this down. No, don't do nothing to it. It's got to dry. Oh, just let it dry. Or we'll get white marks everywhere. You'll wipe more stuff on it than we take off. Such a cool car. Gonna have to get some clippers and clip the wire off of it. Oh, okay. These two pieces go to the hood. Yeah, I didn't know. I didn't want to take it out, so I just left it in there. Well, you could have installed it for me, Josh. Oh, I thought it was out for a reason. Where does that go? Oh, I don't even know. That's I figured it's part of the car. Let me see. Well, that was a pretty good figuring. Yeah. You got any other tidbits of knowledge there, <laughs> Nostradamus? I don't know anything about these. Super cool. Beats me. Josh, look. You have to be able to take something like this and figure out where it goes. Oh, no, you I know where it You see it in the cart, then if you knew where it went, why wouldn't you ask me, hey, this thing here, it's got these little slots. <laughs> Looks like you stick them under this lip, and then these little things snap in, and this would just be on here. Do you want to do this, or do you want me to try to put it on, Nathan? Because, God, this thing would look a lot nicer with pictures if it had the fucking spoiler in it. No, nobody does that. They just tell me, oh, I'm done. And then I'm like, oh, well, but did you? Okay, this is in. I'm gonna leave it, I like it. I don't know how that came off. And this goes to here. All right, good guy. Yeah. <clears throat> Down though, so that's a good yeah. That must have been a broken one to replace it. It would seem so. So. Just include it or? Well, I don't want to. Okay. Piece of shit. Yeah, Probably smoke and smack their window and then. Well, I thought you got everything out here. Come on, Josh. You understand? We're figuring out what everything is and what we're doing with it. We don't need that. We don't need this. I'd like to know where that goes. I mean, finish your job. Don't just leave me a stack of stuff in the fucking seat. I don't even know where this goes. I think I do. Could it really? No, there's no fan shred on this. Wheel well. Wheel well. Yep. receiver for this thing underneath the mirror. One of those Ethernet port things. I don't know if it still works or 
Maybe this for like a handset? Junk. Okay. And then this should I put up under the mirror? Under the thing? No. Okay. Not unless the uh, sun visor is fucked up from it and will look better with it. No. Okay, check this out. This will be your biggest thing. I want you to put this on. You know where it goes. Underneath? I had two shots. First one you shouldn't even think of because they don't have fans anymore the same way. But you got a couple bolts here, a couple of these things here. You can look on that one. You can look on that one to see how it's supposed to go. But it goes right here. Only on the other side. If we have to get clips, no, it goes on this side. Oh. Like I said, you can look over here to get the idea of how everything goes on. Okay. It has all these little bolts here. So if I've got any of them, that's great. If I don't, we can take them off the one up at the other yard, the white one. So okay. it don't look like we've got any of those, number one. Looks like there was a couple clips on the floor. Yeah. And then we have to figure out, man, if that ain't going to come off no better, cool. But make sure you at least, you know, basically, you see that? I want to try a little degreaser and a brush on. Okay. I mean, there's going to be a certain level of degrease that comes off. And a certain level of where it starts making the, takes the gold off. So if it helps it, great. At the end of the day, this stuff has to look amazing. It really does. It has to have been wiped down. This car is really, really nice. Yeah. And I really would like to get that other thing in there. So if you don't have the thing, now we're at a point where you can leave a battery in this one. So put a nice side post battery in it. The red one? No, and that's a dual post. And that's also the one I use for charging everything. You know this, a nice side post battery. We don't use up that one for anything. We only, you know what I mean? Yeah. Once we know what it does, we put the nice side post in. That one has more cranking amps. It's for starting things. Okay. Um, so I'll get one on the charger right now. There should be a bunch of them on the charger. You should have a, a whole lined up a thing. I told you about the one in the red Mercedes. No need for it to be in there. No need, no need for it to be in the Mercedes, the Degyar, the other brown Mercedes. This green Mercedes, this Volvo, this Mercur. There ain't no reason for any batteries to be in any of those cars. Okay. Let me show you something. We gotta get this white car out, or white topped blue car. So that means everything behind it's gonna have to start. That car is getting picked up on Wednesday. The blue car. Yeah. So that has to be out. Okay. So. Between your batteries, figure that out. Move everything. Right now, like can you hit? Can you do that without hitting something? Yeah, <laughs> I can do that, man. Are you sure? I'm positive. Okay. Well, here's the thing. Be extra careful and make sure that you're looking over your shoulder and you're checking. If there's anything you need, check with me. Get with me. Don't try to back the caddy out with the Mustang. There, you'll hit the Mustang or the pole. All right. Move the Mustang. Um, green truck could come over here. Can you arrange everything to where the blue car is, is the, the one that's closest to the gate? Well, no. The blue car is leaving. Okay. So... That's a little different. Yeah. Great. Now make sure it starts in 20 minutes. Josh was supposed to have this all ready. I already, well, I already see all kinds of things that I'll have to do up a bit. Hopefully this will start with the back end up in the air. Or the front end up in the air. Hey. Gonna be moving the bravado. Mm -hmm. 
I'm, if I'm not moving this, I'm not going to be moving nothing. Okay. I think we're going to get a charger on this and um, two gallons of gas in it. Okay. Do we have gas? Yeah, I'll have to get you a credit card and we'll... Okay. Do we have tire stuff mixed up? Uh, yes. We do? Yeah, I have those over here. Where? That. So if we're getting it ready and you know we're getting it ready and you've got the tire stuff out, why didn't you do the tires? Uh, well, that's kind of what we were doing. We just done a motor. So what's left on this thing? Because it's... I think that's, that's it. You think that's it, huh? How about vacuuming a little bit? You said you wiped it down. I can tell right under the pedals it should have a minute and a half of vacuuming. Okay. You see anything else? I mean, that's two things now. So, I mean, windows are a good one, yes. You got all the chrome? Yep. We're probably going to need to get a lot of bolts for that part on the Trans Am. Right. Plastic ones. You tried, you looked, you seen. Yeah, I did look and I, I saw one, just one, but it wasn't even the right one. The one that was inside? Yeah. Um, I need the black spray paint. Okay. Flat black. Flat or satin? Okay. There's ain't no way I wanna. White wall times one. Okay. What are you gonna do? What do you want me to do? I'm gonna head up to the store. Huh? I gotta go get iced. Ice. And a banana.
thing that's dirt. <clears throat> Whether it's be running or not is the question. Aha! Now I hear the fucker pumping. Oh! Listen. The fucker starts up just fine with gas. Runs just fine. The minute I pull this forward. running once we get it started. Okay. But the problem's gonna be we're gonna have to do that with gas during the test drive. We'll see. I'm going to the store. This has got to get washed. Oh, okay. <clears throat> then he'll be here tomorrow afternoon. Okay. Started right up, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, you know, I just have to guess. Even me. <laughs> Please do not masturbate in the bathroom. <laughs> See, and it's only like in my private stuff, so nobody can really see it yet, except for some. And like, it's still already got almost 95 hits or something. Saturday. Saturday is a big day, but like, it might be neat while people, people fucking waste time at work. Oh. That's true. Fucking thieves. Thieves? Thieves. Oh. People that waste time on Facebook and shit at work. Oh. Like who, me? Never been to this store. Oh, look at that. Wow. Wow. Huh? Truck. Yeah. That one's four by. Oh, four by. What's up, man? Hey, man. How you doing? Good. 
Um, just in time. I knew I wasn't late. Um, king size zigzag. One. Yeah, one and a quarter extra thin zigzag. Ultra thin. You got the one and a quarter ultra thin? Uh, they're right there. Yeah. Yeah. Two Newport Gold 100. Thanks, man. So that's not even lifted. That's that's what the what the door bell guy looks like. <coughs> yep. Not in San Diego, you don't really. Oh. I bet this thing wouldn't get stuck even on the beach. You never know. You know the easiest way not to get stuck on the beach, right? Don't go on the beach. Don't go on the beach <laughs> with your truck. <laughs> I never take my shit out on the sand. Then you look like a douche when you're stuck. Yeah, right. Well, you kind of are. Yeah. Seatbelt for when you see the sheriff. Ah. See there, Joss? Yes. To answer your question, yes, I do put my seatbelt on sometimes. <laughs> Just the police. I just don't want to go in here for a bag of ice. <laughs> I don't. Just for one bag of ice. Is it cheaper here? Don't no. they have ice at the... Not the really. Station? It's just not really cheaper here. Oh. Holy fuck, they sell kids on aisle six now. Oh my goodness. Jeez. Uh oh. Wait, you're not going in? No. <laughs> you know my ass hurts, Josh. Why? From running. Right. We've been doing a lot of the gym. I did legs before we went, and then in fact, I did legs pretty hard. And then in the running, in the stairs. It's younger. It doesn't it affect you, man. Hello? Hello? Last chance. Please be hard or something next time. <laughs> She got them tattooed. Oh my god. Have you seen them girls that shave them all? They get them lasered and then they tattoo them on? They have like permanent makeup and stuff like that. Mm hmm. Some girl I used to know did that. Okay, that's, uh... Now she looks scary. <laughs> and her name's Sherry. <laughs> she looks like Scary Sherry. Oh man. But like. Oh shit. Get out of the road, Grandma. Just have a quick plot, but don't, don't do anything like degrees of rise. <laughs> well, no, just make sure it looks really good. Okay. He's picking it up. We want him to be happy with it. Right. At the same time, it's not a perfect car. He knows that. 